Hey guys, welcome back to Korean Caffeine channel. It's been a while since I didn't make some videos. And I recently um, created new uh, stuff with Ionic Angular. Uh, honestly, I like this framework for building cross-platform and hybrid applications for uh, Android and iOS. And I decided to uh, make these new tutorials for YouTube. So uh, if you go in GitHub, in Ionic Team, Ionic CLI, they recently released the version 4.1.1 and um, um, I created a project uh, when I had the version 3 uh, I mean the 4 beta RC I think this was the version uh, the this version in test but they recently um, released the version 4 beta official so um, for installing you I'm on Mac you can type in your terminal npm install uh, dash g. I want to do that. I'm going to go in my terminal and you want to type sudo npm install dash g yonic. I'll type my password. And um, it takes a while for installing your uh, yonic 4 version. I think they released um, yesterday or uh, two days ago the version 4.1.1. So if you type Ionic dash V, you will see that we have installed Ionic CLI Pro 4.1.1. And here you have also the global commands. And um, so for the next video, we will building something like this, uh, a basic application with uh, three tabs. A map with a localization. Um, this is tab two with just some HTTP request. Uh, we can use a model, a dismiss model, some buttons, animations, and also we will install capacitor and motion. This was the uh, test version, so we have some problems with the routing. So if I type Actually, I have to initialize the URL because you know, there was a problem with the uh, navigation with the routing. So here we have in a tab three, the um, capacitor um, camera and motion plugin. So we can take a picture. And um, great. So uh, stay tuned, guys, and uh, I'll see you in the next video.